On May 5th, 1970, the town of Merrimack began operation of its wastewater treatment facility after the Clean Water Act was enacted by Congress. The facility was funded through federal and state grants, with the community contributing 5% of its costs. Today, the facility is meeting current permits, although 40-year-old equipment needs replacing. Jim Taylor, the town of Merrimack's assistant director of public works, explains. The treatment plant's been in place since May 5, 1970, when we began operation, so the plant is now over 40 years old and much of the original equipment is still here and in operation. There have been several upgrades throughout the past 40 years, which has been essential to the facility in a town the size of Merrimack. The project is to replace some of our main pumps, which are now 40 years old, they're inefficient. Our flows have been reduced significantly, um, and also we're looking at adding in a permanent dechlorination system and making some improvements to our aeration system. Funding for this project doesn't impact the town property tax rate as it's funded from sewer user fees. The program will be funded through a bond at the New Hampshire Bond Bank and this will be paid for over 20 years. The funds are based on sewer user fees. No taxes are used to pay for the facility or any of the capital improvements. The project will benefit Merrimack residents by way of efficiency at the treatment facility. We need to continue to provide uninterrupted service, also to maintain compliance with our EPA discharge permit, and also to gain some efficiencies in our operation to reduce our operating costs. 